I mean, it, it's been nice, but I mean, we've been, we've been going pretty hard practicing, uh, working on preparing for that, man. Uh, I think we're well prepared, well rested, and we should be, be coming out with plenty of energy. Thank you. It seems like these two teams are both their your identity has always been kind of defense, and it seems like Irvine too is that. What do you know about them as far as far as that, and do you expect it to be a, a defensive battle? I mean, yeah, definitely. I mean, they're a top five defense in the country as far as field goal percentage goes. I mean, they do a great job on defense and a great job rebounding. And, uh, that's something we got to prepare for and find ways to take advantage of them. Are there are there similarities and differences, or what would you say uh, between the two of you? Yeah, I mean, we got we got similarities just like guarding it. All, similar, all good defenses have those similarities as helping each other and playing hard on defense. And that's the similarities. But I mean, they play a little bit different style of defense than us, but they're still in the gaps and helping each other. How, did, how are you different? I mean, we both we both fight things and pressure the ball. I see, but uh, they go they go under things a lot. They're probably a little more packed in than us. Uh -huh. And probably with the size too. Yeah, I mean they go yeah. double big almost all game, uh -huh. and uh, with that, I mean we have exit the four, so it's like we got four guards. They got two big three guards. So that's you expect that's different. that's the way you guys are gonna go. Is I mean we'll see we'll yeah. see. I mean I, I I can't I don't know where we're gonna be going, but we're just gonna prepare for anything. Do you feel though that that you can you can exploit that some with with the smaller lineup? Yeah, I mean there's always a way to exploit things, and uh, we're just gonna try to find find. What those things are, and the coaches are doing a great job of playing this year. Low scoring matchup. Do you like the fact that it's basically your best against their best, and the way you guys execute both offensively and defensively? I mean, at the end of the day, uh, different teams are going to have their different strengths, and there's this defense, and we're still going to prepare to our best and uh, do our best to come out and play our hardest tomorrow and do what it takes to win. What did you take anything from last season into this season? Uh, that every game is different and it's tough, man. And the NCAA tournament, everybody wants to win. Everybody's going to do their best to win and uh, just got to focus. What's the confidence level like in this team? Uh, very high confidence level, but at the same time have a healthy fear of everybody we play, knowing that everybody can beat us, but we should still be uh, confident that we can win the game. If I showed you a picture of an anteater, would you recognize it? Who? An anteater. I don't think so. Yeah, uh, maybe. They're sort of like, sort of like a raccoon looking, like, I don't know. I probably, maybe. <laughs> Would you know they're native to Texas? I didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, last question I got for you. Just um, overall way of the room, you know, Coach. Uh, Brute, Coach Weber and all those guys. When it comes to it, you feel you guys are confident enough to take a lot of lessons from last season where you made an Elite Eight run and take that into this season? Yeah, definitely learned a lot. And uh, we learned that, I mean, it's hard to, to win an NCAA tournament. It's hard. I mean, we played a 16th seed and we had the hardest game of our lives playing a 16th seed. I mean, everybody's in this to win. It's winner go home for everybody. We got to expect everybody's best shot.